What's up, DTLR Nation? It's the pretty girl, Tierra Lanison. The pretty girl, Miss Kiara. Coming to you live from the Converse studio, and we have a few special guests in the building. Would you guys mind introducing yourselves? Yo, what's up? It's your boy, Mike River. Yo, what's up? It's your boy, EJ. And yours truly, Princeton, and we are Mindless, Mindless Behavior. Behavior. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> yeah, so now that y'all know who we got in the building, don't be blowing up the phone. Cause you know I don't they have are. time for that right now. Yeah. <laughs> but what's going down today in Richmond at Regency Square is you guys are doing the in store. Are you yeah. prepared for the pandemonium? We are prepared. We've done, as this group now, we've done two in stores. The first one was cool, but the second one yesterday was in Philly. And they showed, oh, love. And they showed a lot of love. So Philly, shout out to you Just y'all. excited to see the fans. And we, yeah. MB hasn't been in Virginia or Maryland or any of these places like in the past two years because yeah. we've been, you know, rebranding and working on the album. So it feels good to be back and, you know, seeing the fans that were with us that were in school and now they're in college. It's just, it's crazy. I mean, because I feel the same way. When I saw the, the new picture, I'm they like, grown up. I minute. know. <laughs> like, I remember when I could be like, hey. So I have this drop and y'all was like, shout out to my little homie, Tierra. And I'm like, <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> At that time, I was taller than y'all, but now it's different. <laughs> but um, you guys got a new album coming out. Yeah. Like, tell us how, uh, like you said, you guys are rebranded. And tell us how things have uh, changed from honest behavior in the last two years. Man, so much has changed. Obviously, the look and but mm-hmm. the brand of MB is always the same. It's still quality. Mm-hmm. We sing, we dance, we perform. Our fan base is still there. Our, everything about us is still, you know, classic MB. You know what I mean? So we we just wanted to keep the brand but grow up a little bit. Yeah. And not and not and not make it seem like we're trying too hard. You know what I mean? Yeah, we're just speaking our truth. You know, this whole album. It's just about us, you know, kind of realizing that we're older, uh, talking yeah. about things we all go through. And a lot of our fans are the same age as us or older than us now. So, uh, you know, they relate to a lot of songs. It's just speaking our truth, you know. We kind of have more like, control about that in this album. So we just, you know, talk about what's happening. Yeah. What's your, what's your favorite song on the track that you guys made? Each this one is, of you. This is Princeton. My favorite song, it changes every day. <laughs> <laughs> but right now, it's definitely Come Up and My Bad. My Bad. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yo, this is Mike River. Uh, my favorite song is probably, since we're doing two, uh, Music <laughs> and Lamborghini. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. What you can get the you? mic to Oh, I have to get the mic to yeah. <laughs> You have to so share, Princeton. Um, my favorite, too, since we're doing two, uh, is probably Better. And I'm going to say... I'm feeling music today. I don't know why. Yeah, okay. Music is it's, it's like it right now. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so none of you guys said uh, Song Cry. Song Cry. But song. we're about to get into that, so go <laughs> ahead and introduce yeah. Song Cry to DTLR Nation. Yo, what's good, y'all? This is MB, and this is our new song, Song Cry, Ooh. off of our album, Official MB Music. Enjoy. Yeah. Okay, we're still here. At the Converse studio. It's the pretty girl, Tierra Lanison. The pretty girl, Miss Kier. And we still have mindless behavior in the building. That yeah, was their yeah. new song, Song Cry. Tell us about... The, can what? can we... <laughs> can I Can we it? get a, like, a pretty boy intro, too? Like, oh, wow. Hey, it's, 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 the, it's, the, it's the pretty boy's mindless behavior. Like, what's up with that? I, I had a feeling that's where we was going. That's why I was like, can I finish before you go ahead with the joke? Do it. <laughs> yes, I'm going to let y'all do that as soon as we finish talking about Song Cry. Sure. Y'all got to tell me about Song Cry. Like, what was the creative process behind it? Man, Song Cry was crazy because it really pushed uh, me, especially vocally. Uh, it was a high song. So at first when I heard it, I was I was like, what, well, man? Like, when we're, well, it was just high. I was like, man, can we, can we lower this? Well, I was like, no. You can you can do it. You can do it, and it was crazy. So um, it was just basically us uh, going through a hard time, us coming together and express trying to express like you know you're in relationships and you giving your all to a person, and you know stuff changes when mm-hmm. you know people see you in the limelight and stuff, and just you stuff you know like I said stuff changes and you try to express that, and I just let the song cry. That's basically what happened. Yeah, and uh, the whole Jay Z nod was just kind of a cool fun thing to put in there for you know kids nowadays they don't even know that so yeah. you're like okay that's something new and then the parents listen to it. like okay i kind of remember that something like yeah. that so yeah it was kind of cool dope 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 princeton what about you your princeton? take on it love the record 
I'm just kidding. Nah, I love SoundCloud <laughs> because I think that record, that was the first song that we released at, as a free record on SoundCloud that anybody heard from Mindless Behavior yeah. in three years. Yes. Mm -hmm. The last thing they heard from us was Used to Be, and then it was Song Cry. It was like a big difference, and we just released it on the, on the whim. Like, we randomly told the fans, like, once we reach 15K on Instagram, yeah. we're going to release it. But we were already at, like, 5K racing. away. What? It was real. Yeah. That was, like, a trick. Yeah. It, it was, like, it was well, really We're going to get weird. there in two minutes, guys. Let's say 15. Right. Like, it, but but we were so <laughs> excited. And then like, it, we hit it midnight. We just, like, dropped it on SoundCloud. And then it got such a great response that, like, two weeks later, we actually released the single, I Want That. Mm -hmm. And then the music started flowing. Okay. You know, because we couldn't give them a song and then wait another two years and, you know, like, yeah, tease no. them, so. Yeah, y'all yeah. no. definitely couldn't. <laughs> no. I can imagine the mentions Man. and all yeah. of that stuff that was coming through. Like, so when are you guys coming out? 40-year-old girls talking Going about, I'm crazy. still waiting for the Mindless Baby CD. Oh, my, 40. <laughs> you know, you know I mean? oh, calm down, calm down, Cougars. <laughs> they're, they're not ready yet. They're not ready. <laughs> Look, oh, gosh. <laughs> listen, listen to Lamborghini, Overnight Bag. We ready. But why he had to look at me in he my eyes at, look like at, that? Listen, nah, I'm Tiara. <laughs> I can't do we it. Look, ready? he's still looking. At me. <laughs> I'm not messing with you. <laughs> but yeah, so you know, you guys have done a lot of rebranding. This new song, "Song Cry," you said is way different from what you guys are used to do. What else can we expect from Mindless Behavior? I know you said the overnight bag, and y'all ready. Mm -hmm. yeah. But what else? Like, y'all still dancing? Y'all still, yeah, you nice know, enough. giving them all that? Like, what's, what's happening? I mean, we're trying to give you all that. That's, that's, okay. what, that's the whole... No. Okay. The dance yeah. move still official, though? Oh, yeah, live live performance is a huge part of our brand. Definitely. That's, that's yeah. huge, you know what I mean? That's where we express, you know, what we do. You know, like, the music is one thing. Mm -hmm. We can sing, but it's like, there's not anybody really putting on shows like we're about to anymore, you know what I mean? And that's what we kind of want to bring back to R&B, to just the industry as a whole, you know? Like, people, pe people went from, like, big... Boom, boom, you know, to like everybody wants to be a rapper now. Yeah. Type, you know what I mean? So it's just like we, we got to get back to that. Yeah, just putting those classic elements that NBA already had and then making it something new, kind of how you said, right? Okay. Just more mature. Yeah, okay. more mature. And so mindless like. behavior is still entertaining to yes. say the least, right? Definitely, definitely. So speaking of entertainment, let's introduce this new song that you guys told us about. Song Cry is the first single. I don't know if this one the second one, but I'm going to choose what song I want to listen to <laughs> on Pretty Girl Radio. But. I'm going to let y'all go ahead and introduce this one right here. Yo, 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 this is MB, and this is our first official single, I Want That, from my album, Official MB Music. Enjoy. Okay, there you go. All right, they want it. Let's hear it right here on DTLR Radio. Yeah. Okay, DTLR Nation, that was just a new joint. Well, actually, the first official single, as Princeton That's said, from, from Official MD. Uh, the new joint is available right here at DTLR. Make sure you guys pick that up because that is the only way you will be able to get inside of Regency Square today, Richmond, Virginia. If you do not have that album, you will not be let in. And um, these guys are expecting you guys to be there, so make sure you get that album. Yeah. But let's talk about that first single. Yes. Talk I about it. that. Well, we're based in LA right now. I'm born and raised in LA. Okay. And Mike's from Mississippi. EJ's from Detroit. But you know, in oh, LA is where we're rehearsed. Yeah. And when we were making the record, just the beat to it reminded me of like, I, know, I never said this before, but remember Fancy from Iggy Azalea? Oh, yeah. And remember uh, Classic Man by J uh -huh. Jadena? Yes. It's like those hi hats. And yeah. that beat kind of reminded me of that West Coast Real. feel. Yeah. So we had to get Problem and Bad Luck, bad luck on it because they represented that. And shouts to them. Those are the big know. bros right now. They actually so, performed with us uh, at the, at the BT. BT Experience. Yeah. And we, it, was really, it was a really easy record to record. It's not vocally challenging. Mm -hmm. I mean... <laughs> for him he's, he's it trying, was he's trying to play me Look. right now like well you mean <laughs> nah he's right though he's never right. never I'm just kidding Preston says Always. never but uh yeah the record was uh really dope the choreography is dope and we shot it we shot three music videos like we shot the song called Blur wow. Overnight Bag and I Want That and I Want That was the last day and we shot from like 6am to 6am the next wow. day and we shot on like Crenshaw and Slauson it was just a real west coast it felt good we had like the bikers and the, the you know, low the, riders the low riders and the dancers with the bandanas at a car wash in Imperial Wait, have y'all seen the video have you seen the video no I haven't seen it oh, y'all you need to watch it it's dope yeah, oh. yeah check it out we gonna watch it. Yeah, she's, <laughs> she's like I got it we're gonna watch it shut up <laughs> <laughs> if I could put it on right now on we the big would screen, watch I would. It right now. But as soon as we get off, you need to watch I'm it on my back, though. 
Oh, oh, I do. I need to watch Overnight Bag. Because I just feel like y'all are going to relate to Overnight Bag a little more. Really? Yeah. yeah. Why? Why Why would we relate to Overnight Bag? Let's yes, talk about please it. Please explain Let's talk about that. It. I dedicate Overnight Bag to you. Okay? Now, when you watch this video, mess. I want you to just remember Mike River said that this video is dedicated to, to Pretty Girl Tiara. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Pretty Girl Tiara. <laughs> Got the damn name. He is so Boy. funny. <laughs> For real, I, I know your name. Curly Ed. <laughs> Y'all terrible. Oh. <laughs> I'm Mexican, so this is kind of racist, oh. but whatever. <sighs> Maryland people are just so racist out here. Maryland people. <sighs> wanna... This is what he's going to say, Maryland. <laughs> She's from Baltimore. <laughs> Same thing. Baltimore, Maryland, Virginia, Birmingham, North Carolina, South Carolina, East Carolina, and West Carolina. The DMV is listening right now. There is a difference. There is a difference, there's difference. Princeton. There's a pr- there's All a the ladies are pretty. Oh, thank you. Oh, that, See, that was a nice comeback. That's sweet. That's yeah, that's yeah. That's how that you know. Cool. You bring it all together. <laughs> Yes. So DMV you guys excited about you guys excited about tonight? Yeah, man, I love Virginia. I, actually, our tour starts in Virginia. Oh, our, our, like, we're, this is obviously the promo tour, but right. our mm-hmm. actual tour with the sets and the dancers. Yeah. I believe it starts November seventh in Richmond, Virginia, and mm-hmm. that's where the Scream tour started. Mm-hmm. That's where the number one girl tour started. So every time we start in Virginia, I just feel like the tour goes well. Yeah. So yeah. yeah. Dope, dope, dope. Yeah. So you know, we're not gonna keep y'all too long. Like I said, you gotta go to Richmond, and then y'all going to South Carolina. Man. Then y'all gotta go to Florida. Like y'all tearing up DTLR Nation, and they are expecting. Man, um, I don't know, maybe a few dance moves. Yeah, y'all That's gotta, too much. Y'all gotta okay. give a picture. Them picture. Them. A picture. Y'all gotta give them. Heck yeah! Yesterday it took us know. forever to do the meet greet because we just wanted to take pictures and talk to everybody. For everybody. You know what I mean? That's good though well, because yeah. they haven't seen and y'all they appreciate in a while. it too. Exactly because before. Yeah. We would always, Minus Baby is known for meet and greets. Like, we would do meet and greets every single All day. All the time. And a lot of the fans would come to every single one. But this one that we did yesterday, a lot of them we haven't seen in like three, mm. four years. Did they so bring old posters excited. and pictures? Man, like, they remember old when? Yeah. But I have a good memory. Do I have a good memory or not? You remember? Yeah. I would remember a girl like you were the Why? one that came here and you like, wore this. That matters. And he gives them that my matters. great my memory. Yeah. Like, I brought you on stage in Birmingham. Yeah. Come here. I, never, I was like, you're the one who had this hair, but your shirt was this color, and you said this. But where's your mom? And she would be like, you act. And I give them nicknames. I give them nicknames because I just feel like I feel like Flavor Flav. I feel oh like I'm my giving god! These no girls, these nicknames, <laughs> Princeton, and it, they're everybody. gonna remember it. And everybody was like, ah, and this one chick came up and was like, "It's Sharpie. Remember me? It's oh Sharpie from Richmond." And I Does, was like, "That sounds like you couldn't find a marker or something." Sharpie. Exactly. I give them nickname. I saw the girl wear purple. I called her Barney. <laughs> He got one girl rope because she had, she had like twists and it was tired. Oh my God. And I went on Twitter oh last night God. and she was like, it was nice meeting you, hashtag rope. And I was like, that that's my girl, rope. And they remember oh me. And the, I remember I remember so, them that So way. I'm guessing I you're the comedian. Can I get really? Are you that funny? <laughs> I'm, not, I'm just real. Can I give y'all nicknames? <laughs> no. No. Well, I'm going to anyway. Oh. <laughs> Here you go, Lord. Ooh. Nothing describes them look, more look, look than beautiful, you, oh though. Oh, God. You know what I'm saying? Thank you. Oh. Oh, you woke up. Itsy Bitsy. Itsy Bitsy. Because you know that song she wore? Itsy Bitsy. Polka dot bikini. Ha ha ha. Itsy Bitsy. (laughs) And I'm going to name you Chingaling. Chingaling. Why? Because you look like she would be in a Chingy video. Like, (laughs) live with it. I'm telling you, you you may switch your name. Next time I come here, you're going to be like, yo, what's up? It's Chingaling and Itsy Bitsy on the radio. Uh, Oh, my goodness. (laughs) Somebody get this guy. Pretty girl (laughs) Chingaling. Live with it, Chingling. It's over. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done with you guys. Yes. Mindless behavior, the pretty girl, Tierra Lanison. The pretty girl, Miss Kier. It's a bitty. <laughs> <laughs> right here on DTLR Radio.